<laughs> He's taking an interview. <laughs> can you can you email me the huh? Can you email me this game or no? Wait, say it again? Can you like email me this game or no? Uh I can. Uh I get get permission from coach. Okay. Uh, first of all, but you can see the whole game. Okay. It was a great one too. <laughs> what year are you? I'm a junior. Are you gonna play in college? I'm trying. Hmm? I'm trying to, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, so 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 yes is the answer. As a matter of fact, let me get you on camera. Right now, <laughs> come in and interview him. So, what happened today with uh, number uh, uh, nine? Uh, we had some good at bats. I struck the ball pretty well at the end of the game. I was I had an 0-2 count, <laughs> but I managed to hit one off. Got a walk off, so that was pretty nice. Okay, okay. And hey, what do you know about it? Uh, he's down 0-2, but he stayed aggressive mentally in the box and was able to get us that winning run. All right, on three, get okay. together. Go Cyclones. One, two, three! Go Cyclones! Go Cyclones! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I'm trying to put that second Harlan game back on that UIC date because it's open and that's a 7 o'clock on May 2nd. That's a 7 p.m. game. So it's always moving parts. That's why I'm, I'm begging for the communication I have to have. Right now, if we don't have that game, we do have practice tomorrow. We need to come out and be ready for that. We have to be confident and become confident in playing whatever position we get put in. Okay, uh, yesterday we had the little infield practice, right? You guys big and need to hit me one, hit me one, hit me one, hit me one. And I was hitting them little slow rolls. And what I say, them the hardest ones to pick up, and they was hard to pick up today. Ooh, baby, they was hard to pick up. Them shots coming down to you, bam, blood wide open, you can pick them up. Them little slow roll, didn't know what to do with it. He had two come down there, didn't know what to do with it. Do I charge you? Do a one hand glove? What I'm gonna do? He picked it up, but you didn't finish. Set throw. Set throw. All over the place. Run. Set. Gun the ball to where you're throwing it. Get square. He told three guys today. Point your shoulder where you're throwing the ball. You open the ball to go in. Wheels Rizzo. We had guys over here on the bench. Can I run for him, coach? Can I run for him? Nope. I don't think that coach over there gonna let you run for him. Yep. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> and I told them guys on the bench, I say three pitches coming down and he's going. That's what happened. We know what we doing. Good job, runner. Good pitching. <laughs> hey man, hey, wait, wait. Got a guy over here with a little attitude too. He's a gamer, that's why. That's the only reason why. He ain't no selfish player, he's a gamer. He wants to know why the coach took me out. Why? Because this is a team sport. We got guys that can pick you up. You're gonna pick the next guy up, the next guy up, the next guy up. Don't be a selfish player. Game, I'll answer already that question know. I don't, owe, I don't owe it. I took you out because I care about you. Because you was already at 98 pitches, and if I try to extend you, you were, you, you were looking, your, your, your fastball was not where it had been, and, and the, the breaking ball was, was dropping short. below the plate. And hey, I mean, this guy's seen it the inning prior. We know what we're doing, player. We know what we're doing, okay? <clears throat> it comes down to reading everything. I want to ask Riz, I want to ask you a question. Originally, what was the first thing that I was talking about? I said as far as sealing or running on the first guy. What did I say the first time? But I said, we're not going to steal right now. But then, 
I looked at the catcher. I looked at him throwing, throwing the, ball the ball back to the pitcher. I said, what? He's not impressing me. I'm not impressed. So as soon as I saw his arm throwing the ball back, observing his ability, that's when I said, we're going to steal on this guy. That's something that you all have to start doing. You have to start critiquing your, your opponents. If you don't critique your opponent, you're not going to be able to pick them apart. I saw that guy wasn't didn't have the ability anywhere near that that other catcher had, so I knew at that point that I was going to run on him. He Those threw three balls, players. and they all went over the second baseman's head. They went in the center field. We know what we're doing, fellas. You all just do what you do. <clears throat> I got uh, three things. One uh, play where we had the, the brain fart, the entire infield, and we let the runners run around on us. That's something we all have to pay attention to, not just the pitchers. So the middle infielders, you got to be talking. Third base, you got to be talking. Uh, number two is Colin, tremendous hustle. Randy, tremendous hustle. Everybody, hustle. Hustle won us that game because you guys hustled. That won us that game. Okay? Uh, the third one was you never quit. Nobody quit. We were all a little bit slow to get going into it, but by the fourth, fifth, sixth inning, seventh inning, everybody was into it. You never quit. That's what I've been looking for all year. <clears throat> we started short, and, and, and I critique constantly critiquing. Critiquing when you're not in the game, I'm critiquing your interactions with the rest of the team when you're not in the game. I look at everything, guys, everything. I had, what, three or four guys that were on the bench, <clears throat> and I had one or two guys that started out all the way into the game. As the game progressed, then everybody came in. I need everybody engaged throughout the game, whether you're in the game or out the game, totally. Um, not just on on um, plays on the field, but just simple things like getting foul balls. And I know Aiden may help, try to help out, but that's not their job, man. It's not. That's our job to get the ball. That's seven bucks, six or seven bucks out there that just land out there. So <clears throat> if you're not going to do it because <clears throat> I asked you, then do it because it's money. It's, it's real money. If you leave two or three balls out there, that's 20, 20, 30 bucks just laying out there. So let's keep that in mind. Look for a text tonight. Otherwise, what I need you all to do is to come game. I want you to come game ready. I want you to have green jerseys, uh, short sleeves, green, and white pants with the uh, green um, piping. I need you to have that with you tomorrow, clean, in case we end up getting something during the day where we end up having to travel. It might happen, so uh, keep that in mind. And make sure you get all the stuff to the table. We got to get grapes, water bottles, coolers. Nobody leave without grabbing something. All right! Cycle on South 3, family on 3! Wild South 3! Cycle on South 3, family! <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> and folks, here we are with the uh, head coach at Chas High School. And uh, a few words, coach. <clears throat> Just wanted to um, talk about the game really briefly. And um, I uh, won a pitcher today. Mm -hmm. uh, ended up winning um, game in seven innings, one in the bottom of the seventh, uh, five to four. Winning pitcher uh, Vinny Ernesto had uh, nine Ks and uh, had a, a dynamic performance once again on the mound. How you doing, uh, Coach Johnson? Um, here at uh, Chas High School Agricultural Science. Uh, just finished up a game with uh, against Curie conference game, our second conference game against them. We uh, pulled one out yesterday and uh, today had a dynamic uh, performance by uh, pitcher Vinny Ernesto who had uh, nine Ks. Won the game uh, five to four. Uh, great performance, great uh, command on the mound. Uh, just want to um, <clears throat> let Benny say a few words about uh, where he is as far as just let us uh, tell us about uh, the South. Tell us uh, where you are in school and uh, <clears throat> a little bit about yourself. Time now slide into the picture with Coach. Well, how you want to do yeah, it? Yeah, you can, you okay. can go to him and a little bit more and go so my the beginning of the baseball season i actually didn't play i had bad grades but 
I studied and I worked hard to get back onto the team and start playing again. And over the past couple of games, you know, it's we've been it's been up up and down with the, the scores and you know taking a couple of losses, especially when I'm pitching and uh, you know. And uh, today I was just I was just very uh, happy to take the win today. All right. Yeah, we had uh, we had a few guys that had a couple of uh, issues. Vinny's a very good student, though. He's a very good student and very uh, very coachable young man. So uh, that was just uh, that was just a, a situation where he wanted to just make sure that he got where he wanted to get in in that class and um, make sure that uh, you know he was um, in a um, in a proper form as far as his academic uh, career was concerned. That's why we sat him down for a few games. Okay. But uh, he's a great um, great kid, very coachable, um, and uh, loves the game. So that's that's what we're looking for. Okay. Well, number thirty two, you. Um are you planning a career uh, baseball in college? Uh, yes, I am. Okay, and you are what year? Sophomore. A sophomore. Plenty of time. Yes. That's yes. graduating class of? 21. 21. Yes. <laughs> yes. Have you, you wanna... given any thought to your major? Um, something to do with like sports therapy or like, hmm. like movement of the body pretty much. Yeah, okay. Something like that. Cool. In my opinion, I think whatever he chooses to do, I think he'll be successful at it. He's uh, he's that type of kid. So the, the main thing that we want to do is we want to instill his courage and his uh, courageousness and the, the rest of the team is what we're looking for. And we have quite a, quite a few of the, the players. It's just a few players that need to catch up to him. But he's a great kid, and uh, going forward, he's going to be a big part of the team. Super, super. Thank you, folks. And... Uh, Go Cyclones. Go Cyclones. <laughs> <laughs>